it's Mario Fan 520 and welcome back to another movie review. Today we are going to be talking about one of my favorite classic animated Disney films. And before we get into this review, I just want to say that this is going to be my first review for probably my second review for Disney Movie Month considering I already reviewed Wreck It Ralph. But anyway, look. Today I'm going to be talking about Aladdin, one of my favorite Disney films of all time and one of my favorite animated films of all time in general. And it's definitely one of my all-time favorites. And this film and this film basically tells the story of of a street rat named Aladdin. He's technically a person who has his best friend Abu with him and later comes across the kingdom of Agrabah as well as a lamp that contains a genie that will give him three wishes. And he must use these wisely in order to benefit him and impress a new woman he has come across known as Princess Jasmine. But there is one big problem. An evil man known as Jafar is going to try to get down to business and take care of Aladdin once and for all. I seriously don't have to go through on um, the popularity or of this film technically i don't have to mention that this film is a highly revolutionary film it's a masterpiece it's a classic i seriously do not have to mention that because if you were to make a list of a classic disney films there is no doubt no doubt that aladdin would not be on that list this film is amazing. Aladdin is a gorgeous looking film from its visuals to its animation, its background scenery, its music. This film really has it all. One thing that really does make this story so engaging is the characters. The characters flow perfectly throughout the story. Aladdin is such an amazing character. And you can obviously tell that this person is trying to be a somebody. He's tired of being a street rat. And and since he's come across Jasmine, he wants to try to impress her. He wants to be the guy to fall in love with Jasmine. And he even has to go through courses on pretending to be someone that he's not. He pretends to be a prince named Prince Ali. He pretends to be this extremely charming prince towards jasmine even though he's just a street rat he doesn't want to he, the idea of our character of aladdin is very fascinating considering that this character has his downfall moments but he develops throughout this film and princess jasmine is obviously one of the most iconic princesses in animated history not just disney in general and we cannot forget the genie, played by the late Robin Williams, is absolutely phenomenal in this film. One of my favorite Disney characters from one of my favorite actors, rest in peace Robin Williams. Aladdin is a really fun film, extremely fun film that has perfect sceneries, a lot of magical and thrilling elements, masterful hand drawing animation, Fantastic characters that you cannot step away from. Funny side characters. And amazing messages for not only kids, but the entire family. Another thing that makes Aladdin stand out as an iconic animated masterpiece is the music. <clears throat> Aladdin is filled with so many iconic soundtracks and songs. Just from the beginning all the way to the ending of the film, this film is absolutely phenomenally well done. And part of that is due to its amazing songs. And personally, my favorite song from this movie is Arabian, Arabian Nights, which is obviously in the beginning of the film. Now let's talk about the scene that occurs in the opening of Aladdin, which revolves entirely around the Cave of Wonders. That is honestly an absolutely chilling scene. And honestly, there's a lot of drama that's well-rounded in, in those elements of the film. Of the Cave of Wonders. And I found that to be very interesting to the story. Talk about the villain Jafar. 
This is definitely on my top 10 favorite Disney villains of all time. This man is absolutely flawless as a Disney villain in my mind. He, I mean, he has everything that a Disney villain should have. He has henchmen. He has a talking macaw or parrot. He has a heavy mind. He has tension. He even has power. And he can turn into a giant snake. Jafar is without a doubt one of my favorite Disney villains. And one of my favorite animated villains in general. Another thing that I will say about Aladdin is that this is an extremely layered movie. This movie really does have a lot to say with its characters and its story and its amazing and magical direction. And the, apart from the fact that this movie is very dark, Aladdin is a very strong animated film, and it knows what it is. The amount of care and effort it took to make this animated project is absolutely mind-blowing. It is fantastic on how well-made this film was. Another thing that I really appreciated about this film is that this film takes perfect sense a perfect a, a perfect sense of middle eastern times this film has a lot of elements of perfect of perfect middle eastern settings and considering this story takes place in the middle east nothing really falls flat everything feels so ancient and so amazing in this film Aladdin is an extremely revolutionary animated film, <laughs> and what honestly is there more to say about this film? It's an animated masterpiece. This film is a classic. It's a Walt Disney classic, and it'll remain as that way as generations go on. <laughs> it holds up very well with other Walt Disney classics, classics such as The Little Mermaid, The Lion King, Beauty and the Beast, The Jungle Book, Sleeping Beauty, Cinderella, Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, Fantasia, Tarzan, Lilo and Stitch. The list goes on. Aladdin is an amazing looking film and an amazing film in general. This is a highly revolutionary Walt Disney animated classic that I think will always be remembered. And this is not only one of my favorite Disney movies of all time. It's one of my favorite it's one of my favorite animated movies of all time and one of my favorite films of all time in general. Aladdin gets an A+. So guys, thank you guys so much for watching this review of Aladdin. Look forward to more movie reviews that I'll be doing for Disney Movie Month. You guys are the best. I love every single one of you. Thank you guys so much for always watching. And as always, I am MarioFan520, and I will see you next time. Peace out.